guess my first question for you is I, I work a lot on continuing dramas and it's well documented that's sort of where you started out. How did you learn your trade on those shows? What did you take yeah. from those shows? Um, the biggest thing I took from working on The Archers and on Coronation Street and a number of other shows was discipline. Yeah. How to write a script. Um, you'd get the storylines, it would cover everything you'd discussed in storyline meetings, mm -hmm. but then you could turn it into your own. So yeah. if you did have a massive story with this boring as shit, <laughs> you didn't have to write that, you mm. could concentrate on a tiny story about a character you did like about like and turn that into a massive story. Mm. And um, that's where I learned that story is hard work. Mm. It's, stories don't just come out of yeah. the ether. You know, a, a tiny idea for a story might come out of the ether, but yeah. the rest is hard work. The rest is planning and plotting yeah. and really thinking things through. How how do you approach development? Mm. How does that work for you? How do you deal with development hell and, and what do you think development um, hell is? It's awful. It's frustrating. I find it really difficult. It's um, I, I don't think you ever get used to it because you you put as you know you just put so much passion and effort and time and writing is so personal. So when people reject it, it's personal. It's not easy. It's you know it is one of those where you never quite know how to deal with it. I used to just swear a lot. You know I never got used to it. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe it made, just made me work hard. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. A lot of writers, actors, uh, artists. Mm. <clears throat> are full of self-doubt. Do you know how good you are? I've always, I've always known I could write dialogue. Since I was about 11 or 12, I've known I could write dialogue. It's like it, an innate mm. knowledge mm. that you have. It's like being able to draw. I just know I can do it. Mm. And it's something I've spent a lot of time thinking about, working on. I've read so many plays. I've studied it. It's something I'm passionate about. It's something that excites me. So I believe I've got something, mm. but um, you pro you're never good enough though, you, never, you, you always have self-doubt, you always worry that something isn't quite good enough, that it could be better. Uh, I remember a writer telling me when I was younger that writing is like a muscle, the more you practice it, the, 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 the stronger it'll get. So even if you get knockbacks, write, keep writing, just all the time practice writing. Mm -hmm. I like the bits about of writing that are quite like I feel like when I feel like a mechanic. Mm. So I kind of like putting words together in the right way and writing something that is evasive. Moment where you can be a little bit clever. 